All right, so um, this is going to be just a short video kind of showing something that's coming. Um, a bit of a sneak peek, but also just kind of a discussion. So um, the, the Disney Plus Vision series was the anime uh, Star Wars series, and in there there's the Ninth Jedi episode. And one of those episodes uh, includes a character called the Margrave. Um, and basically, it, in the scene, he, uh, he pulls a saber away from a, a Sith Force user, and the second he gets the saber in his hand, it goes from being Sith Red to a Jedi Green, um, signifying that he's actually able to take over the crystal of that saber, um, and the saber reacts to him, and actually that's a whole other part of the storyline. Um, but I've seen a few attempts at this effect, and I know there's fonts out there. Um, but what always gets me about the, uh, vision, the versions I've seen, and I know why they do them, um, but they have it as an ignition effect. So in the actual episode, uh, the Sith users has that saber ignited for quite a while, and there's a whole back and forth discussion. And it's only when the Margrave takes the saber that it changes. So having it where it's doing it automatically or some kind of a timed effect doesn't really align with what actually happens in the episode. So in OS 6, there's actually several ways to do this. Um, this is just one way. Um, there's actually other ways to do this. Um, you can do it gesture-wise. You can do it with a, a few of the other new capabilities. Um, but I wanted to show this because um, if you're going after those um, kind of cool effects or you want to do these type of Kyber conversions, um, we do have capabilities to do it. And we can make it so that it's a one-way change, or we can also make it so that it, it goes back and forth if you want it. Um, and we can make it buttons, and we can make a gesture. So just the endless and endless and endless possibilities. But I wanted to show this one. So the saber's been ignited for a while. Um, it's in the Sith user's hands, and then when once the Margrave gets a hold of it, now I set this one up for a button change. Um, you could do it with uh, other ways. Um, but now, as soon as I want to, I can take this Sith saber and turn it into a green saber really easily. Oops, I hit the wrong button. And now I've got my green version of the saber. And what I actually did was I set up a sound for it. So it's actually got a new ignition sound. Now this version will go back and forth. You can also set the one-way version up. Um, and there'll be more discussion on that because that's some a whole larger package of capabilities with uh, the addition of the interactive um, effects. There's actually two methodologies within those interactive effects to make it so that the effect only occurs one time or only can really uh, go in one direction or you can have it so that it can toggle back and forth. So this one's going to toggle back and forth. I'm not going to talk over it this time. When it makes the change, it's actually going to reignite. Um, and it, it's just a style. There's no um, special coding required. It's just how you build the style. So every time I want, so I can have it so that this saber actually reacts. I can give it to my friend. He, I can tell him, hey, you're a Sith user. Um, and then when I take the saber back from him, as soon as I get it, I can say, guess what, I'm not. Um, and this reacts just like it does in the actual episode. Um, so there'll be a lot more discussion, obviously, once OS 6 is out of beta, um, just because the, uh, you know, I always say this, but the, the endless possibilities of what we're going to be able to do in OS 6 um, is, is far beyond just the effects on the blade. It's actually how your saber reacts to you. And there's so many new ways to do things with gestures, with... Uh, interactive effects with different control levels with all the color editing um, there's just going to be so much that it's really going to be up to your imagination um, and, and but being able to mimic what actually happens in the episode for the Margrave versus just having it as some kind of an ignition effect or some kind of timed effect I think just makes it even better um, so and no knock against the other versions um, they don't have the capabilities obviously of what we're going to be able to do in OS 6 um, but for me, when, when I was watching the episode and then when I was seeing the videos, it, it didn't make sense that it was an ignition effect to me. So, and I, I'm usually trying to go after very specific things. But now we're going to have that ability where it's on demand, it's when you want it, and it's also going to be how you want to control it. Um, so this is just kind of a, a sneak peek. Um, there's a whole lot more coming. So hope you enjoy.